What's that? Go get it. We had eight dogs and we were not a nonprofit at the time and several people kept on telling me you need to start a nonprofit so you can get assistance to help and you can get more dogs because we are pretty maxed out out of our budget. We are called Angel's Eyes Sanctuary and the reason we're called that is our first blind dog, her name was Angel. So now we're up to 17 dogs. Two of them are not part of the rescue but the other 15 are, eight of them are either blind and or deaf, and then we've got some that have other issues, and we've got a couple that just needed homes. We had the fences secured. We, you can't have a coffee table because the little guys will jump off the couch and land on the coffee table. When you come up our stairs, there's a rubber mat at the bottom and there's a rubber mat at the top. The rubber mat is their braille. so. Once we got, you know, the porch secured so they can't fall off the porch, that's when we went, okay, once you get going, this is pretty easy. They play, they take care of each other. The ones that aren't blind or deaf help the ones that are blind. Our last one we got less than two weeks ago, and she is Bumper. She came from a good home. She's only seven months old. She's a husky, and she has a condition called ataxia. So she'll never be able to walk normal, but she's getting stronger and walking better already. We've got three double murals, and all of them have hearing and or sight issues. <laughs> Bumper got it. Norman, leave it. Four of them on, are on meds constantly. We go through two large bags of dog food a week. Most of them we don't place. Once they're here, they stay. A lot of them are Montana names. We have Clancy, Clancy Montana, Two Dot. We have Townsend, and we have Fort Benton, and we have Quinn's. Dylan and Dixon, nobody lives in a cage. These, they sleep in the house, they sleep on the porch, they sleep in our bed. We are no longer accepting right now just because we're at 17 and it's Kenny and myself taking care of these dogs. Visit and sit on the porch and enjoy and, and watch them and, and we love sharing them. Just because you have a handicap doesn't mean you're handicapped.